It's Sugar Rose Studios, and today we're going to be doing another Retired like unboxing. I'm super excited because these came literally right before Christmas, and I was like, oh my gosh, and I'll, I was like, I'll wait to open them on Christmas, just because that's so exciting, so yeah. Okay, so let's open. I have a box, and I also have a package, so I guess I'll do the package first, because I usually do packages first. This package was from Mercari, which is one of the places that I get like all the time and if you're wondering where i buy all my like i have a really amazing video where i talk about all the awesome places that i buy my like and you should go check that out okay so that's like my face every time i open open a package i'm like Ugh. okay i'm pretty sure these guys were like body quality so oh yeah definitely body quality but that's okay i use these for customs and things anyways and horses that i sell online so here is the Lipizzaner Mare. She's a very pretty mold. I have one of her still in the box, which is so rare, but um, I will definitely use this one for a custom or a repaint. So I'm not sure what I will do on her, but color suggestions are also open. So leave those in the comments as well. Um, let's see, the next one I have here is the Retired Arabian Mare. She is super duper cute. I love her face. She's like, her pose is just like so sweet and delicate. They've actually done a lot of Arabian mares, I feel like, and she is so just so adorable. But definitely body quality. She has a bunch of scratches and everything, but she is super cute still. And I have so many like ideas on what color I would do her because I feel like it's just such a pretty mold and she's just so sweet. I feel like she could just have balance a butterfly on her face and it would just be so perfect. Okay. And lastly, in this package was the Palomino Stallion. He is for sure one of my favorites. I love him. His face is so detailed, and but he's definitely body quality as well. Um, definitely a lot of scratch marks and paint and lots of specialness. Okay, now let's open this package. I think this one was from eBay, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, they actually wrapped them. That person just left them all together to kill each other in the package, which is a do not. I need to do a packaging video. That is next on my list on how to package model horses, or like at least because Briar and Schleich are definitely different for packaging. Much paper. Yeah, these are definitely, oh my God. This person, person drilled holes in this horse oh my god well you know it's okay I can fix that but um I didn't realize that's interesting they drilled a I can see through it um yeah this is the retired Hanoverian mare um and I think this is the first time I've ever gotten a horse with holes drilled in it, so yeah, that's that's interesting. I've done a lot of customs on this one. I love this mold. It's actually, I think, one of the molds that just, like has sold the most of ever, actually. I think that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, I've never gotten a horse with holes drilled in it, so this is a first for me. Okay, moving on. This horse, I know, does not have a leg, so... That's okay, I can fix that, but um, yeah, this is the Lusitanio Stallion, the retired, or gelding, retired Lusitanio gelding. What the heck, this person drilled holes in this one too? I don't know what happened to these horses, but it is like abuse. These were abused retired, like, and I'm very sad, but that's okay, I can fix this with epoxy pretty easily, so I'm not that worried about it, but it's kind of really strange, I'm not gonna lie. I want, they drilled holes in Okay, this one also has a hole drilled through it. I don't know what was going on with these horses, but I'm a little confused. Um, okay, this one, they must have been like car carousel horses or something. I don't even know. Um, this is the retired Tennessee Walker Stallion. He has a hole drilled through him as well. Um, yeah, he's really cute. I'm gonna do a custom on him. I've done lots of customs on him as well. 
And this horse also has a drill hole in the stomach. Um, this is the retired Andalusian Stallion. He's super cute. I love him, um, sort of. I don't like his tail at all. I hate it actually. Um, but other than that, he's pretty cute, so I'll probably custom him and fix his also apparent hole. Look at that. You can see right through it. That is insane. You can see my eyeball through this horse. That is really weird. I knew that the horse didn't have a leg, like, but I knew that this one didn't have a leg because I said that in the description. Um, but I don't know if I would have bought these horses if I knew that they had a hole in their stomach. I just don't know, like, what were they doing with these horses? Alright, let me turn you guys around and give you the other look. Um, really strange. Tennessee Walker Stallion with, again, drill hole. And the Andalusian Stallion with the drill hole. A um, Lusitanian Stallion with a missing leg and another drill hole that has tried to be filled there. Don't know what happened, but. Um, <laughs> then the other package had the Lopezoner Mare, the Arabian, and the Palomino Stallion. So these are all these wonderful horses. And it's okay, I don't really mind. I can fix these, so it'll be interesting to fix our friends here. That is it for this unboxing, and don't forget to stay sweet. Mwah.